Hello everybody and welcome to another unboxing video. Now, this is going to be one of the biggest items I have unboxed so far on my channel here. So, I am not going to tell you guys what it is right away, but it is from M. Meg Sun. I've got my surgical scissors here. Surgical scissors are always handy to cut this open and get it out of the way and opened up. So these are pretty sharp surgical scissors, so do be careful if you have a pair of your own, so you do not slice up your fingers, because it will cut you. Ugh. Here we go. Alright, so this item I got for a, a home do-it-yourself project. So, oh, hey. This is what we got instead of popping paper. Where's my popping paper? Oh, there's a spider in it! Holy shit, you guys! Look at that! There was a mother spider in this box! I didn't pay for a spider! That sucker's huge! Apologize for that. That caught me by surprise. I was just gonna say that there's no popping paper, and I was a little sad about that. But that's okay. I just got a big gigantic surprise. Whew. Anyways, back to the item, you guys. Holy cow! Well, all right. So this item right here all right is as you can see it says fragile fragile that's got to be italian i think or something no i'm just kidding hopefully some of you will get the reference but anyways it is fragile it is a type of glass item that still freaked me out dear lord All right, be very careful with these scissors. Now, this item here, we'll pull it out very, very carefully, because I do not want to damage it. This item is a solar panel. Now, the do-it-yourself project that I wanted to do is I want to get um, at least a little bit battery backup in our house. For when the power goes out, I want to get a battery for this and everything to get this um, set up for in-home charging. Now, look at this. This is absolutely awesome. Now, the maximum power that this can output, I'm just going to let you know. Here, I'm going to bring this down a little bit. The maximum power that this can output, all right, now it can be mounted either way. Um, anyways, the max power is, well, you guys can't see me, is 20 watts. Um, current at um, P max is 1.15 uh, volts. Yes, 1.5 volts. Um, let's see. This goes on here somehow. Um, open, open circuit voltage. Um, it can, I do believe, pump out. Um, 20 volts, um, or something like that. I think it's like 21.42 volts. Um, uh, this feels like a pound or two. Um, but the max system that this thing can be hooked up to for voltage is like 600 watts. Um, but as you see here, each one has a tiny little photo cell. Um, that powers up the device, and up here is where it is. Now, let me, um, rotate this around. As you see here, that, these come with this, and it comes with a special little plug, so that you can, uh, attach some clamps to it. 
Um, it does come with a, uh, I do believe, a six foot cord. Um, but what I want to do is I want to get a bunch of these put together and make it for a in-home battery backup system for solar powered. Um, oh, hey, there is a way to open this up, it shows. Let me see. Open. Oh, what's this? Hmm? There is a way to open this, and you can uh, fix the resistor. You can hardwire it instead, too. So you can hardwire a bunch of these together. Um, so you can do that, and that's what I potentially plan on doing for my do-it-yourself in-home project, is getting a bunch of these wired up and set up and working. Now, the cool thing is is it's got its own stand to sit here and charge. Now, I do believe, testing this out, oh yeah, there's some current coming through there. It's not, it's not that much. Oh, hey. It's not that much current coming through here. Um, but, you know, um, I do want this for a do-it-yourself in-home project um, that I have potentially planned for uh, a do-it-yourself thing. Um, now, I'm going to check to see here real quick. Let me grab something. We've got light shining on here. Um, it's not going to be very, very much unless it's, you know, full-on, you know, sunlight. But I want to get a LED power strip here and see if we can get this powered up with just this alone. So we've got the positive. I'm going to clip that to the positive lead here. And I'm going to want to clip it to the red. Why isn't that lighting up? Oh, there we go. It's lighting up. All right. So as you see here, you can't very see it very well, but the, uh, there we go. The red is currently lighting up, as you see there. It is powering it on. It is, because if I cover it, I can see it dimming. But I'm going to pull this over here a little bit. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get one of my bright flashlights here, and I'm going to shine it on here really, really bright. As you see, it is lit up. There you go, you can see it lighting up, getting brighter, and everything. Um, works actually really well. Um, it's not much voltage, but if you get them daisy chained and stuff like that, um, it will make it brighter. Now let's see the other colors, there should be blue here. Blue is not lighting up from that much power. What about green? Can you get green to light up? No, we cannot get green to light up either because there is not enough power going through it. Red is the only one that can light up. But nonetheless, um, this can be used for maintaining the battery on a vehicle, on a boat, um, and numerous different things. But I wanted to get this for a do-it-yourself do home you know, battery backup system, considering it comes with these kind of clamps. Now, I am going to be getting a converter for it, for the said um, battery backup. Now, it can be mounted in numerous different ways, like you see here. Um, I don't believe it can be hung. It can be hung. And that's probably what I'm going to end up doing. But I want to bring it down here. Actually, probably not. But nonetheless, it comes with a stand. So, if you guys love this item and you want to get it for yourself, for a do-it-yourself in-home project, I will leave the link to the item in the description. Um, if you guys want to try it out for yourself, like I said, links in the description. Um... I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing video, unboxing this very, very, very special item that we have today. 
Um, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. I apologize for the very beginning. That was very su surprised for me, and I'm sure it was a surprise for you guys, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video so far. And if you did like it and love the little surprise that I got included with this item, give it a thumbs up and leave a shout out. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. If you love this item, check it out for yourselves. Um, thank you for watching. Bye.